guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I wanted to do a quick little mascara routine. I wanted to show you how I apply my mascara, which steps I take, and yeah, that's actually it. I don't have anything more to say. I use um, one drugstore uh, mascara and one high-end mascara. So if you want to see how I achieve these lashes, then please keep on watching. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe to my channel and give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you again for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Okay, so before I start off by applying mascara, I always use a little comb. This is actually a, I don't know, a comb for your eyebrows, but I'm going to use it for my eyelashes. And what I'm going to do is just comb through my lashes, making sure that everything is nice and straight, like so. And then I am going to take my eyelash curler, uh, which is from Essence. I believe it's a few euros, very cheap. Um, I always use this one because it just does the job, so I don't have any fancy expensive ones. I like this one, so that's what I'm going to use for today. So I am just going to make sure that almost every hair is in the eyelash curler, and then I'm gently going to press and I'm going to be careful because I don't want my skin to be in it because that hurts and I'm just going to like press little by little and then I let it go and then I can tell that it's not the way I want it to be so I'm going to do it again making sure everything is nice and in the eyelash curler, well every hair. Okay. That's about it. So what I can tell is that they're not completely straight. So before I'm going in with mascara, I'm going to take my comb again and combing through the lashes because I'd rather comb with something without mascara than using the mascara one because then it tends to get a little bit clumpy. Moving on, I'm going in with the False Lash Maximizer by MAC. This is a white primer that I used before I applied my mascara. And this is just going to make my lashes a bit more longer, a bit more fuller. And I'm just wiggling the brush through my lashes and making sure that every hair has at least one coat of this beautiful product. Just a little bit more. Can you tell how long this product makes my lashes? So now that I'm done with this layer, I am moving on to mascara. And um, the first one I'm going to use is a drugstore one. This is by L'Oreal and it's the telescopic mascara. I've been using this mascara a long time. And as I told in the intro, I wanted to do one eye drugstore mascara and then the other one, my favorite high-end mascara. So let's go into it. This is a mascara with a very small comb and I really like it. I love it actually. So I am just combing through my lashes and I'm actually wiggling the brush. So I'm going left to right and that way I can make sure that every hair has some mascara on it. like so. 
Can you tell that I hate my outer part of my lashes? Wait, I will zoom you in. Do you see this? Like, I have those very short hairs at the outer part of my eyes. I don't know what to do with them. And some of them are just going straight. And then I just take off the mascara because it looks weird. Because everything is like nice and round. And then you have like one hair going to the right side. And no, I don't like that. So this is a one layer of that mascara. Normally I just wait for about 30 seconds before I'm going in with the next layer. And while the first layer is drying, I am taking that same comb again and I'm combing through my lashes, making sure that I get rid of all of the excess product. So I don't wanna have clumpy lashes. Sometimes I actually like it depending on the makeup look I'm wearing, but when I don't have like eyeliner, then I don't like it. And I try to look down in the mirror because I don't want to have mascara on my eyelid, especially when you have eye makeup on. Now I think I have like one color on, so it doesn't really matter, but um, most of the times I just don't like it. Okay, so now that the first layer is dry, we are going to add another coat of mascara. Really pushing the lashes up, like so. I think my eye looks very scary because I have big eyes, and when I apply mascara, it's just way bigger. I think we're done. And most of the time, I just use two layers of mascara, but then only when I use the false lash maximizer because there's already one layer of something on my lashes. And I don't like to apply an extremely amount of mascara on my eyelashes because it just gets clumpy and then you get those spider eyelashes. I'm afraid of spiders, so we're not gonna do that. So this is actually uh, what I do. Two layers of mascara and one layer of the false lash maximizer and again this is the the telescopic mascara by l'oreal so now that i'm done with this i am just going to do the other eye and for that i am going to use the mac insta krill lash mascara which is pretty awesome because it has a very thick mascara wand like so and then when you twist it here it just curls can you tell hello out of focus yeah there we go do you see that that's so cool Okay, so this is the MAC Insta Cruel Mascara combined with the MAC Falls Lash Maximizer. I did the same thing as I did on my right eye and I used two layers of mascara. 
I didn't do my bottom lashes yet and normally I would use my favorite mascara, the MAC Extended Lay, uh, but I lost it and I don't know where it is. So um, for now I am just going to do um, the Insta Curl for my left eye, don't mind the broken nail, and the L'Oreal Telescopic for my right eye. <laughs> 